Hey guys, how's it going? I'm Court McGinley. Today I'm going to be talking to you about six things you didn't know everyone could do. Number six, brain freeze. With summer right around the corner, I had to put this one on the list. I know there's going to be a lot of ice cream and freezies going around, and with that, sometimes comes brain freeze. Now first I'm going to let you guys know why brain freeze occurs in the first place. It's because the nerves at the roof of your mouth freeze from the cold item that's hitting them, and that results in a headache. Well, luckily I came across this quick fix to help you out and prevent that headache headache from taking over. All you have to do is press your tongue against the roof of your mouth. Now I'm not talking a little tap. You're going to have to push as hard as you can if you want that brain freeze to go away. By pushing your tongue against the roof of your mouth, you stop it from becoming too cold and stop that sudden headache from forming. Number 5. Cough the pain away. Now this one is pretty handy if you're scared of needles or rather the pinch you feel when you're given a shot. I know I am. Just after you're injected with the needle, let out a little cough. Turns out this will Will decrease the little bit of pain. This is because coughing actually decreases pain signals to the brain, so therefore you will feel less of it. Unfortunately, this only works when you're in a little bit of short term pain, such as a prick from a needle. But if you break your arm or twist your ankle, this pain is longer lasting, so this trick might not work as well. Number four, cure heartburn. Nothing is worse than lying down in your bed after a long day and then all of a sudden heartburn hits. It's pretty painful and it's going to prevent you from getting the sleep you desperately crave. Luckily, I have a tip for you that will help ease your heartburn, and it's a pretty easy thing to do. All you have to do is sleep on the left side instead of on your right side or sleeping on your back. The reason this helps is because the esophagus and stomach are actually tilted at an angle and when you sleep on your left side, your stomach is lower than your esophagus. Number 3. Go back in time. The mind is a very interesting thing, but so is your sense of smell. Our sense of smell can actually take us back in time. Say you smell a certain flower or perfume and then you smell it again years later, it will actually bring you right back Back to the first time you smelt it. This is because the part of the brain that's responsible for smell is located in the same place as the part of your brain that's responsible for memory and emotions. So the next time you smell something and it brings you back to a memory from years ago, you now know why. Number two, bye bye toothaches. Did you guys know that you can easily reduce the pain from a toothache with ice? I know a lot of you are probably saying, of course we know that you just wrap up some ice in a towel and put it against your sore tooth. Well actually I have a more effective way that you might want to try. All you have to do is take an ice cube and rub it against your thumb and index finger and surprisingly it will ease your pain. This will literally cut the pain you're feeling in half. The reason this works is because your neural pathway, which is that little V in between your thumb and index fingers, keeps pain from going to your face. I'm getting my wisdom teeth out later this month so I'll definitely be trying this. It's, uh, it's gonna be a little more intense than just the toothache but it's worth a shot right? Number one, stand up. Yeah, believe it or not, people stand. Shocking. No, I'm kidding. Now this one is slightly scary. So for this you're going to need to grab a friend or family member. Now what you're going to do is ask them to sit in an armless chair with their feet flat on the floor and with their back straight and their head facing forward. You then ask your friend to stand up and sit back down again. Once they are done you're going to place your finger on their forehead and apply some pressure. Next you're going to ask them to stand up without using their hands and without wiggling side to side. Now what might shock them and even you is that they're not going to be able to stand up. The force from your finger makes it impossible. How crazy is that? Go ahead, give it a try. Well there you go, that's our list of the 6 things you didn't know everyone could do. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you soon.